We are getting our first look tonight at the Scripps Ranch father whose gun killed a 10-year-old boy. Prosecutors say the gun was loaded and left where children could find it. Good evening. I'm Kimberly Hunt. And I'm Steve Atkinson. Todd Francis was formally charged today, and tennis reporter Allison Ash was in the courtroom for the small battle he managed to win. Well, here in court today, Francis won the right to keep on seeing his daughter who was playing cops and robbers with a neighbor boy when a gun went off, killing that 10 year old. For the first time, we're getting a first hand look at Todd Francis, whose gun killed this fourth grader. 10 year old Eric Claes and Francis's nine year old daughter were playing in the garage of the Francis family's Scripps Ranch condo when a single shot rang out, mortally wounding the little boy. It's very unfortunate. It's very tragic. Um, all of the family members are, of course, devastated, not to mention the other neighbors, the other children, the other families. Francis claims the gun wasn't loaded and that the ammunition was kept in a separate place. But that's not what the prosecutor says. Well, we're contending, obviously, that it was loaded that it was left loaded in a place where children can get to it, and that's where the charges stem from. Those charges include involuntary manslaughter, child abuse, and criminal storage of a firearm. He pleaded not guilty, and his attorney objected when the prosecution asked that Francis not be allowed to see his own daughter. The court uh, insightfully commented that um, the child has gone through enough, as it is, um, and she needs to have access to her father you know, as necessary. But that access could change if Francis is convicted because he now faces a possible seven years, eight months in prison. Francis was ordered to only see his daughter if another adult is present. He and his wife, we learned in court today, are now separated. The little girl is now living with her mom. From the Hall of Justice downtown, Allison Ash, 10 News.